Hi friends, today we have a very notorious patient called Dummy. Now this patient had lot of saliva in his mouth and we, he was very happy that I am unable to do any procedure because of lot of saliva. So what I did was I purchased this thing called Octadam. I thought that this would work fine with him and he liked the color too. So what I did was, was I purchased the small size one. I thought that this would fit in our dummy patient. Although we have the size medium and large in this Optadam. So what we did was we checked this out and it says that it is a similar thing like a rubber dam conventional but it has inner frame for itself. There are two rings as we can see the outer and the inner ring. The inner ring will be placed in the buccal vestibule both lower and upper and outer ring will be placed covering the lips. It has some markings as resembling the template which we use for marking the tooth number in the rubber dam. So we punched the hole for the molar over here the right mandibular molar that we need to treat for this dummy patient. Now I think that he will be able to get it done our treatment done with the help of this optadam thing. So we punched the hole and there was a hole over here as we can see that the hole has been punched. Now what we will do is we will place the clamp right over here so that it is easy for us and we instead of placing the clamp inside that dummy patient who will again ignore us and again will do some notorious things. So we will first place the wings of this clamp directly into the punched hole from both the sides and get it engaged like this and once we are done so it becomes a single unit now our unit is ready as we can see that clamp is ready and our complete rubber dam set is ready this after dam now is ready so we have this uh, white rings over here you can see now what we will do is we will engage these white rims and bring them both from upper and lower aspect closer together so that we can hold it with the help of two fingers and now it will be easy for us to place it in our dummy patient now let us see how our dummy patient see he is already opening his mouth he is happy to see that ki we are placing something new in his mouth so he is widely open now what we will do is we will engage the vestibule or we will engage first the buccal aspect as you can see from one side and engage the inner uh, ring that was there which we are holding and so that we can engage from both the sides now so we have placed it comfortably now white rings are hanging around so what we will do is we will slowly upper lift the upper lip and engage it in the buccal vestibule for the upper segment or the upper arch similarly we will proceed for the lower arch and we will engage it in the lower vestibule for the engagement of that white ring in the lower aspect so now this is almost completely done in one go and our frame is completely set into the dummy patient and he is comfortable he is not crying he is not doing anything and now what we can do is we just need to place that clamp on the tooth that we desire to operate so what we will do is we will hold the holes on these clamps with the help of clamp holding forceps engage it and now we will place it on the molar tooth for which we had punched the hole so this is as easy as it can be seen over here so once we place it engage it at a proper place on the cervical aspect of the tooth that we need to engage now we will comfortably remove it so we are done comfortably now our patient was happy and we could do the procedure but we were worried about why or how we are able to disengage this rubber dam or the opera dam in fact from the dummy patient as he was happy he was continuing after the procedure that he wants to be holding this in his mouth forever but we thought that ki how he would be happy how would he eat so we need to remove it so what we did was we just again disengaged first the clamp from his mouth so that he will be able to disengage the optadam so now we could bring up bring close together from both the sides so that we can first remove the lower aspect that was engaged in the dummy patient and then once we were able to disengage from the lower aspect easily and we could remove it from the upper 
lips or the upper aspect so it is easy and the dummy was very happy that his treatment was also done thanks for watching bye bye